So we will start our welcome by the executive director of Chinggis Han Memorial Foundation, Ujedin Chodong. The first of all, can we all stand for a movement of silence in memory of our founders of Chingsan Memorial Ceremony? Uh, Washington <laughs> On the behalf of Mongolian Cultural Association and Chinggisan Memorial Foundation, I would like to extend seasonal greetings and all warm welcome to everyone. In addition, I would like to welcome representatives from Permanent Mission of Mongolia to United Nations, uh, Ms. Gawa Madl Altengadl, uh, Ms. Tuksochir Jatsen, Ms. Amar Jergil Tumur Sok, and representative from Mongolian em Embassy in Washington, D.C., Ms. Olan Arumbold, Ms. Nima Dolchisram, Ms. Arona Adya, and Paul Chikmut and Unkjir. Unutrin Uptuk Chihar Yavt Yavtit Vega, Hristopodane Chinis Hanet Helek, Amrkur. Neolongatic, <laughs> Today's ceremony is 29th annual ceremony held in America. The Mongol American community arrived here from different parts of the U.S. to pay respect and tribute to founder of our Mongol nation. Beside year-round memorial service held by Darhat Mongolian artists, South Mongolia, many different memorial services uh, organized by Mongol living throughout the world. One of the characteristics of uh, Mongol American Chinggisan ceremony is that we have representative from all major Mongolian tribes, including Hazara Mongol, Tuba Mongol, Helmuk Mongol, Burad Mongol, 
southern and northern Mongoli Mongols. This is one of the unique characters of today's ceremony. This shows us also how diversified today's Mongolians are and unifying power of our great Khan Genghis. Even though we speak different dialect or different language, living in the different country, we gathered here today to memorize our common ancestor, great Khan Genghis. When the Abakti Jaga Unodri Chinsane Terabal, Amra was earth which had lived in the Kuluk Mongolian, Umusum was in Jilin Tor, Chuburlobe, or Klumbul Gusteristen, Olamjila Terabal now. The wound be Unjilin Telgi, Johan Berluk, Earthmong, Oyo Samojilin Domjil Gusten, Amraki Mongolian Sali Halone, Kolok Nat, Chins Klasan Halhachehan, and his Gajana. The wound near Ham, Unjilin Telgi Tulum Mutter. Tolgan or Sun, Chinsane to Scalesami Homus, a Stalha Jahan is Kaya. On Chen Dr. Nuk Jilgul, when Jilin Delgin, Tom Bell Commission, the Lord Hitting Jalachit, it be her or Chit, Chen Dorazan, your Tostom was a banana. Be the girl Jalachit, much better to a high school in hand, than an American monkey in Olomjila, Yelgan, Nun Sena, or Nun, Telegrosin, Nun on Jalachit, Darajil in Telek. Today's ceremony is a continuation of traditions studied by a small group of Mongols living in America. They, they worked tirelessly last 30 years to keep this wonderful tradition alive among the Mongol community. For this, I would like to express my sincere thanks to board member of Mongol Cultural Association, uh, for providing us materials and financial support. In addition, uh, some other people uh, contributed different way of uh, making this today's ceremony possible. Uh, so either providing labor or uh, donating balls or uh, lamb and so on. I cannot name everyone uh, one by one, but I would like to express my sincere thanks to everybody who helped us this year. I also would like to express my thanks to a member of Chen San Memorial Foundation who participated in organizing of this year's event. Uh, those who, uh, also those who volunteered to help us many things throughout the last several months. Without their help, it is not possible to have today's ceremony. And we can tell a toggle caragaga, toggle last but not least, I would like to welcome Mongolian shaman coming from Mongolia and thanks to today's singers and performers. And I wish everyone enjoys uh, today's ceremony. Thank you. Sorry, <laughs> Зургаан сарын 2-нд үүсгэн байгуулагдсан хөлөг юм байна. А гэрлийн өргөний зорилгонд тэнгэр үйлчлэлээ дэлгэрүүлж зөв агуулгаар хөгжүүлэн ил талд ерөнхийн уйлдаа холбоог судалж үндэсний үг уламжлал яс цаашл суу ухааныг тодлон түгэж дайн дэлхийг гэгэрүүлэхэд оршино. So I would like to invite our shamans who are visiting from Mongolia and they belong to an organization called Gerling Urgo. And the organization was founded three years ago with the purpose of reviving and invigorating the ancestral shamanic tra traditions and Tengrism in, an, in the modern era. The group has members all over the world, including Mongolia and other parts of Central Asia. Please welcome our shamans.
So they'll do a small explanation of what they're about to do, and then in some parts, the, the audience can participate. So this flag represents um, sky, Mongolia, and land, and it represents our vital connection to our nature and our eternal heavens, right? And also, um, through this ceremony that they're about to do, it all re reinvigorate our heritage, the blue spot, the blue spot of Mongolians, that, and it will encourage us to love our land, to love the the nature we live in, that we'll be protectors of it. And they will lead um, some, what do you call it? Yeah. Praise. The, the praise, yes. They'll lead the praise for us. Yeah. Uh, please follow him. Please follow as he starts. Hinger. 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 Mongot, 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 Mongols of the world, we have a great responsibility for this planet to take care of it uh, wherever we are and be united as well. And we'd like to end this ceremony by singing a song, a song that most of you would know. <laughs> Please join us in our singing. Um, as you know, we're not professionals, so uh, bear with us. Please don't run away if we start singing. We're not the best singers. <laughs>
I'd like to invite Dr. Sanjastam, the president of MACA, to the podium. He will lead the uh, ceremony for us. So, um, I want to welcome everyone. We they represent Mongols from all the different regions. The, uh, uh, the ceremony starts with the reading of the Ezinsang text by uh, Huan Jin, and this is uh, an invocation to uh, uh, to Chinggis Huan Jin. Ashtin Amulangi Herlin Sairha Ja Sot Bogot Chinggis Han Ujin Hatne Hamtar Jaya Tushmit Nugut Salta Bugdor by Sat Soir Ha Arun Tahal Sitkil Lugo, Jahat Kin Agun Lugo John Amte Burtusen Ipene Dej Sune Amte Burtusen Ashane Shimmer Ching Sitkiller Chengul and Tahoe Ta Bogot Chinggis Nugut Lugo Nigna Arun Yich Tahlan Jawla Badrun <laughs> Unutujis, Amte Dikan, Ark Sakatan Urgnum, Ajusan, Yugan Soy Hall, Ashtin Angling Hairland Soy Hall. Shall we prepare the lamp offering?
gentlemen, present the, the case to the office. I'm going to read the cube text. Abrakcha Han Bobut Chings Hatun Hing Gigan Dan Han Abu Lachnatan Hamuk Mongol Urstan Aaron Ninder Hiban Algin Derin Didich Hunt Kalin Tailan Yitin Husur Sultan Urknum Bida Urksner Rushach Amsnar Altrich Botsnimin Buton Hairla Prepare the wine offering. Present to Yonan and Yonan make the offering to the altar. Hamburg Chingus, Hatani King again, then Hanno Lachinartan, Hamu Mongol Luristan, Olson Sartne Ditch, Olson Taranesim, Sartin Ditch, and Gachin with the Lurunum Beta, Erusunim and Jogton, Amosunim and Edmo, Alter Meritan Dorsaso, Alton Sorodit and Dagaso, Ochim Boschagit and Manaso, Ola Bodotit and Sakiso. John reads the testimonial text and all young people repeat each stanza. De tingres teate. De tingres teate. Til ki tuna ivelte. Til ki tuna ivelte. Til gir mongolan mandosan. Til gir mongolan mandosan. De turut chingis han. De turut chingis han. Altan del ki dalferte. Atun Liki Dalta, Arun Juk Choriate, Arun Juk Choriate, As your pig dance looks on, As your pig dance looks on, Alter Rikit Chingisan, Alter Rikit Chingisan, Hafsnan Hamtrosan, Hafsnan Hamtrosan, Hamad Mongolan Mitkissen, Hamad Mongolan Mitkissen, Hand will see Babelson, Hand will see Babelson. Harya ikit Chinggis Han. Harya ikit Chinggis Han. Aku neri tan mataso. Aku neri tan mataso. Awa will see tan dorsaso. Awa will see tan dorsaso. Atun boshri tan hamgalaso. Atun boshri tan hamgalaso. Asid kodom ti tan sakiso. Asid kodom ti tan sakiso. Al kodom tan batrat. Kal kolum tam batrat, kacir orum tan dekjeret, kacir orum tan dekjeret. Unsun muksatun hujet, unsun muksatun hujet. Ur hujetan urnitwe, ur hujetan urnitwe. Yonan reads the auditory text and all young can repeat each name. Awa bakdin uris, awa bakdin uris. Atun yastne turun, atun yastne turun. Awo turun hamalak, awo turun hamalak. Alter borcigit tuğel, alter borcigit tuğel. Ulus mangolin turd, ulus mangolin turd. Ulan jürgeren çıtıksın, ulan jürgeren çıtıksın. Turun gülüp isin ördük, turun gülüp isin ördük. Tedne uris tuğel, tedne uris tuğel. Hangi gavin odum orna? Hangi gavin odum orna? Hamad Mongolin uzgin otkin. Hamad Mongolin uzgin otkin. Halon gavam tek sakin hamgalak. Halon gavam tek sakin hamgalak. Halka Mongol çok tuğel. Halka Mongol çok tuğel. Tengir olna sengin davan. Tengir olna sengin davan. Tenun sakin tan noktadan. Tenun sakin tan noktadan. O Saidan Batlan Hamalak, O Saidan Batlan Hamalak, Ur Mangacho Tugel, Ur Mangacho Tugel, 
자, 저거 낙도 조금 구는 때야 좀 한국어로 타네 한이 지내 이렇게 떴다가 떠들지 않음. 자, 한이 지내 그게 한국어로 때 흔들 시간 서열하. 호래 호래 호래. 자, 애로드 멘트 애로 날은 또 이렇게 추도 애로 타용 애로 보는 호래 호래. All the children under 17. And please follow the sister at the back. <laughs> the children's praise now, and all the children, please come forward. <laughs> Now, 
for this ceremony and we hope that we will cooperate in the future in the coming years and some of the Mongol Rider Motorcycle Club members even came from Chicago. Wow. So thank you so much for coming. So our Chinggis Hamdi Mora ceremony continues. And we would like to invite our next speaker. Tarachiha Tachigurya, Mamatosas Nikun Nibao and David Sora, Bangin to the Chiarch, Hat the Aquamaris, Kwamarzi Tapu Tiumin Ustben. I would like to invite Mrs. Kwamarus, Deputy Permanent Representative of Mongolia to the United Nations. Thank you very much. brothers and sisters, ladies and gentlemen, I am very honored and privileged to speak at the opening of the 29th annual Genghis Khan Memorial <coughs> Ceremony. Mongolia celebrated the birth of Chinggis Khan on 
the 31st October. This anniversary is held on the first day of the first winter month according to the lunar calendar. This year it falls on Monday, the 31st of October. It is a public holiday. This day is also considered the National Pride Day. Монгол улс Чингис хааны хаа төрсөн өдрийг энэ аравдугаар сарын 31-нд тэмдэглэсэн. Бэлгийн тоолын өглийн тэргүүн сарын эхний өдөр энэ хүү аав тэмдэглэдэг. Энэ жил аравдугаар сарын 31-ний даваа гарагт тохиосон. Энэ өдөр амралтын өдөр байдаг бөгөөд ил өдрийг мөн үндэсний бахархлын өдөр хэмээдгээ. Washington Post acclaimed Genghis Khan as man of the millennium in 1996. And the UN General Assembly adopted a special resolution <coughs> in November 2005 to celebrate the 800th anniversary of the foundation of the great Mongol state worldwide. The resolution noted that the nomadic civilization has played a significant role to develop a wider trade network and to establish major administrative, cultural and religious centers. Following this decision, the Genghis Khan and his Heritage International Exhibition and various conferences were held in Germany, Austria, Hungary, and many other countries. American Washington Post said Genghis Khan was the first дэлхий дахинаа тэмдэглэн өнгөрүүлэх талаар тусгаа тогтоол гаргасан. Энэ тогтоолд нүүдлийн соёл иргэншлэн нь худалдаа, арилжааны өргөн сүлжээ хөгжүүлж, захиргаа соёл шашин болон худалдааны томоохон төв байгуулахад чухал үүрэг гүйцэтгсэн юм гэж тэмдэглэжээ. Өг тогтоолын дагуу холбооны бүгдээнэ гэрмэ ус Австр, Унгар зэрэг олон орон Чингис хаан ба эзэн түрүүн сэтгэлд үзэхлэн олон үсэн эрдэм шинжилгээний хуралд зохион байгуулах зэргээр өргөн дэл өргөн дэлгэр билээ. Genghis Khan's historic role has been highly praised internationally and it is inevitable for his descendants to remember him and to be proud of his endeavors. The annual celebration of the great Genghis Khan birthday in Mongolia is an important way to introduce history and culture of not only Genghis Khan but also the Mongolians to many countries and peoples around the world. Genghis Khan is the first time to be able to live in the world түүний үр хойчд ихэдсэн хаанаас санна дурсах үйл хэрэгээр нь бахрах сэтгэлийг эрхгүү төрүүлж байна. Тиймээс Монгол улсад жил бүр ихэдсэн хааныхаа мэндсэн өдрийг тусгайлан тэмдэглэх болсон явдал нь Чингис хаан төдийгүй Монголчуудын түүх соёлыг дэлхийн олон орны ард иргэдэд үнэн зөвөр ойлгуулах, сурталчлан таньуулах, түгэн дэлгэрүүлэх зэрэг ачаал бүтэлтэй юм. In this regard, the annual Genghis Khan Memorial Ceremony is significant in preserving and promoting the Mongolian culture for Mongolians in the United States. Taking this opportunity, I wish to thank the Mongol American Cultural Association for its tireless efforts and valuable contribution. In Uttara, Jilpur Zohan Bagalsbu, Chinggis Khan in Tachlaq Arkhenjian, American Institute Mongtin Soyli Tugan Dilgruzin Hamgaz Khad Chukot Ajal Bukhita. In Zafshani Gashiklan, in Khu Uust, Nuntia Hoi Nemir Arulj, Үчин чарвал гаргаж бүй Монгол Америкийн соэлий нэгімдэг талархлаа элэр хэлээ. Finally, I would like to express my sincere appreciation to the organizers. I wish everyone present here a very enjoyable afternoon. I thank you for your kind attention. Эцэтэн энэхүү архэмжайг тахуан дагасын хүмүүс чин сэтгэлэн талархлаа элэр хэлхийг үсчай. Энэ цулд хорн цулдарсын хүмүүс энэ өдрэг сайхан үнгүрүлхийг хүсэй ерой. Анхаарлт эсэн байрлаа. Хатагтаға маарал сах үүг хэлсэн байрла, тэгээд ас манаа энэ сүүға, нүйорс сүүға нүүбийн түлөлхэжийн гадзар маан. Олуу ус дээд хавцан монголийха нэрийг гарар монголий түлөөлэн бас бидний захуан баагуусын бүх монголта олбаад үүл ажилхан байан орлцан дэмждэх дэх талархж байна. Thank you so much, Mrs. Bamaru, for your kind words and we really appreciate your constant participation and support in all the Mongolian activities that are organized here and also thank you for representing our country on the international arena. Alright, so we will continue our program with more representatives from different Mongolian communities. Zada, Mongol.
Олон жилийн төлөөлөгч ч дээсөө ориад бас үг хэлүүлээ. Хамгийн ихний манай төлөөлөгч бол Туваа Монголын төлөөлөгч Андрей Кужугет. Тэгээ наш орох гэсэн. Тэгээ Андрей Монгол өв сангийн Монгол өв соёлын сангийн удирдах зөвлөлийн гишүүн бөгөөд 2014 оны 2014 оноос эхлэн Чингис үйл ажиллагааг дэмжиж оролцож байгаа. Андрей Кужугет from Tovan Community is a board member of Mongolian Heritage Foundation and has been actively participating in the Chinggis Han Memorial Ceremony since 2014. Please welcome Andrei Kuzhuket. Сайн байна уу? Hello, everyone. Здравствуйте. I'll try to speak English so everyone will understand. Just some brief introduction about Tuva. Tuva is a very small republic in the geographical center of Asia. It's it's located on the border with Mongolia, but it is part of the Russian Federation. So we have very similar culture. Uh, and traditions and so on. So it's it's very rare actually to see a Tuvan person in in the U.S. because um, maybe like uh, East Coast there are less than ten people and in general in in U.S. there are less than twenty people. Um, so for us it's a it's a very big honor to see our um, flag uh, at this ceremony and actually be invited and and participate. So. Um, we would like to uh, thank you guys for uh, inviting us. Um, like she mentioned, this is our third time at this ceremony, and um, if somebody um, came for the first time, I, I hope. You guys are very excited because um, there will be amazing show, there will be yummy food and, and so on. Uh, you guys will be very happy after the ceremony. And if you came for several times, I hope you see the changes and the changes are uh, to the positive side. Like this year we have a bigger hall, we have, um, um, uh, we, we have uh, much more people visiting from all over the world. Some people even came from Mongolia. Um, so in the past, Chinggis Khan, um, he united different people from different tribes and he built this great Mongolian empire and um, nowadays I can say that uh, Maka organization, they're doing kind of similar thing for 29 years already in a row. So I would like to um, thank uh, Maka organization for, for uniting all of us at least once a year and, and that everyone can wear their national dresses and represent uh, different uh, places. And um, we would like uh, to thank uh, Maka organization with some uh, little two one presents. Um, first present is the, um, well, it's a, it, it's a two one drawing. I, I guess it, maybe it's it's a little bit different style, but I, I still uh, would like um, Mac organization to have it in, in their collection. Second question, uh, second present is um, is a CD with the throat singing. It's a uh, latest band and uh, hopefully so, uh, something new in, in the musical collection of Maka. And the third is is a bottle of vodka, <laughs> Chinggis Khan. <laughs> the two of us say the birthday is very good if you have very good vodka. <laughs> Thank you so much, and I wish you guys to, to have fun and um, to be happy. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much, for Andre. I, I was waiting for the vodka to come up. <laughs> Thank you very much, Andre, for the generous gifts. Andre, 
is the main organizer of American Kalmyk events and is a leader of a band called Arnotak. Hello everyone and thank you very much for inviting us and I'm very honored to represent uh, Kalmyk community and little remark, my last name is Churyumov. <laughs> And I'll start in Kalmyk. Mendev tkhursun onemtin. Iki kizenesi naran Mongol kenrin irkin önür törül sadın dunde dörvün ördi gijineren turchi yosun mana öfknir. Ödget sagim yosarmadın jirje yovnaydin. En süürti khurje irsin i enkir akhnir ekchner ezin bogde aldır Chingiz khanan tekchi maktat Onchta öne tem deljenevdin. En bayrin sürgü huraga bürdeci kesin emtinde evren örkü bölünlerin derese bolun hursun olun geçinresi halun bülen ögen kelcenevdin. <gülüyor> en kesken tüp kerek üldürte madın şulunga keder orulçce enkir eyci avin gazrası holu bəvi çegin Mana nerin oğun dumde, ülgür üzümcü bolce, sansın tortkan, nomin öser bütkı boltka. Ser sergisin salkta, bür bür kesin hurta. Darhı kiyitin uğağar, halkı halun uğağar, ondin dörvin çakte iğici hurci, huçna yosan sergeci, amır amuğun gedilci, çedil bağı küyünde çengiz xan çedil urgacı. Sürdür bolsun mana aldır cangır, sürü bolce, em emen tüşülce, ekti sähin duğan dolce, sen sähin yuhigi, zünnemin burxıt mana, avı eçin zayan seküsün, gazır usuna seküsün örşece, evacı bol tha. <gülüyor> Yürüyüşümüzde <gülüyor> 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 Aydın çünkü size namtar namtarı koşmak maşık tostte. Diye das ana ana mağdurun sütü mut muhtere ev nihtte bi nihte dimcim mağdur kandiri gidiyor der arjasa gecüstüge. Our next speaker is Mr. Bacharat Batoya from the Buryat community, and he was born in Agim Buryat. It's actually where my grandfather was born. I gotta talk to you later on. And he professionally he's a doctor. And he loves reading the biography of our um, Hang Chinggis Hang, and he also wishes that all Mongols around the world are united and also represent Mongolia well to all the other nations. So please welcome Mr. Pascharov Batuyev. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. <laughs> How are you? When did the Arab song? Ve Mongol uksağatında Mongol nut, Buryat, Halmogut, Tuva, Hazar zanutta, Horol Hanlanda, Elşitta, Amerika Mongoli asetasyon ajanşitta. Amerikan Buryat bulgumu zuguho namaha anangole oho ojo Şengiz Khan'e olguydu umdeyhan onho Halum Bayar Amar Mendeye örgünüm. Bu kada monodur, hayırmen garundurum onu ne yaparın tavunda, Princeton kotada, Çingiz Khan'e hari günjöle dursaldılar olan hendur umurkuk işe soldurabatıyor. 
Америка гурмне, ямар бирха, ордолху, рокша ханате, баян, лане талахарадак, демократична гурмгеша. Екатен, Сингас Хане, Турхан, Тапта, Маунолда, Хайл, Хайл, Менга, Арвон, Хайл, Андаха, Турхан, Хайл, 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 Найман Бехмут Унгургатак Бена. Чингис Хан, Ухате, Зане, Уханда, Оржия Дахар. А вы их улигарту, Хуинья Бадалара, Унгу Кукатингрин, Ильвейхан Кунгажа, Зане Дурсханда, Орган Бена. Вангулок Саратин, Чингис Хан, Борханда Шутин, Чингер, Кундалдек. А вы из Римны, Гижа, Дердедедек Бена. Чингис Хан, Хайртахин Янган, Жиле. А у них алтар солоту кунгжа, юнескин карган тавилар болана. Чингисхане юкхам бойем ухи дурхан зане, ажо хумдая намтрея ириндолат анда зуб тежин болгангем отануди орин дашал захалчита бишкшир ты убия. Мини аналар Чингисхан тохе зуб тежин бишем. Он же не мог со мной не усутопша. Хальмак Ириндзин Хардава, Менга Йохунзон Хардава, он тоже был Чингисхан. Француз Жан Рине Чингисхан Дижа. Ораде Лев Гумилев. Ибор Монголе Сайшиев. Чингис Тухе Ульвернут. Англо-американский Бушикше Лев Уэйдерфорда. Чингисхан ба муно саре бибалалга. Чингисхан тохе алун намут, кина нут, бульвер тох нут, челхе юлда алун балда карак дживеде. Нёсу табшуде егеж бишна. Визум бокте чингисе ининфикихе алун ва хатан, ухи буденге югу шалор жбе хада. Алун балде ворга саролат, бокте нидуриге сатмбаролат охлотти гива. Бокте охо Усыдар бунгой хохолуба, тигет олым борга аха, негул олгат хохололуба, хенинши я хохолжи шадыгуэ. Энешеды, эпте, ите, сопта, хамты, ябыкты, хендыш телдыху бит вихм бэйна. Терегэхэр сашыда маунгул оксагатын нилыжа, дэйсыда каража, мухи бумбысык дылхэйи худан вихм бэйна. Терун нёсы топшыты бурне хуэлэ жасык ясы егэж бэшна. Охм, гол, газар, бодрловал, толгайн сазы. Не уншықта ямур, хату, зарилығы бешіп, гүжі хадады бұйғал. Сақ-сақ ара, сақымзы күкору, гүжі нарады, арды, амин, амин ұғы бәйқа. Мұны болғыда, ямур шоқылы, тайлығы бұйға бешіп, орықша күтім қолым зон жүл, қарады күм бұйға болына. Орвотин Менганжоле и Хинда, Куне Андержевеем Бегали, Азар Охун Агар, Мутеше Балазагаже, Ухендон Медеж Вене, Вилхем Гиха Хайнгурне, Ба Оне Муне, Жоде Хайнгурне, Арундраган, Оне Топтонгор, Бегали Хригеха, Арундраган, Тарка Вихун Вене, Увидову, Куне Андержевеем Бегали Волха, Сашата, Увидову, Куне Андержевеем Бегали Волха, Жишень, Бегал Дале. Бухи дылхэн зане амугар хатык, эйхэ шатык қазыр. Муна бұл хаты бейгілі оғын күне қада күсор. Жыл күріп бағы мұхай бұлына. Маңғыл сатыны күдей олым, зоң мен күн жыл ажы оғын қазыр. Хинши хана амур бейхі яғы. Маңғыл ұқсағатын бұмбырсық дылхэн, лады донды қорғажа. Үпті еті байын күндір, үрі күңгіда күткіжа. Бурхан Чажина, Хилие, Мартангуи, Амгалун Тевен Джабая, Чингисхане Турсхали, Туркундо, Ханже, Явахам Бухидал Хензон, Мандак, Мандак Волтре, Талим Бургуду Буркша!
Mr. Balakhudlik Din was born in Shijin Qadur, Mongol, and he's the founder and executive director of Asia Leadership Development Network. Please welcome Balakhudlik Din. Good afternoon. So, it's an inquiry. It's a new tour of Horton Chokson, who did touch and have condemned three Amarabi. Unutri and two hundred of Scott Wither, Arkham Jogi, the Humber, which Tabit Nick, Hampton Horn, Sogdot, and Bottom Nuchi, Hangat was booked together on the Rosson Marking, was the Mongol, Amrix Hoyde Havana. Hamilton, you Itu untuk terin kacar hantan coklat orang coklat seman, ok tetes ok soil, unsur yang bahkan tuh tirisan gigi baca. Mangkuk coklat itu bahkan kacar itu masih ada betul. Tetapi tak cukup dengan terminit tak kurus juga. Yang sudi itu tak cukup dengan itu mana yang biar cincisan yang urut itu, itu ok tetes cincisan dengan tadi itu. Tuhan kami ini tam waskur ni baik kalau jauh sengit jauh bahkan ikut itu. Tiada betulnya uk deh itu pelatun dah kau dah cut dah kau tak sahaja. Negeri itu itu jauh sengit ikut waskur ni dan dah tam berkatang bukan tak kau sen. Tak sahaja kau batal kau jauh jauh sen. So betul tu betul 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 tu jaga. Betulnya uk deh itu min hij betul sen wisin wadmur betul tu unu turjik sen. این اندر نبخته است. دیگه دایار اندر چیست؟ ناتر آدرن چیست؟ که دویده تو دو یوهی سنی کرشتی جگه. دانگانچ مانگر چه دویده تو دو بس. آرچو این دیگه این دوکن ماش تام هوچی دختر سون. چینکس هم هوچیت جسر 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 جگرگا. خویلی کان دار آدم آدم آوگایم کت وسکر نی جنگتن آدرن چیست؟ آتین سویی یار کین سویی ته هدوج. اونوترین آرچا هفتا. Teknik mereka jadi, seorang hari saya ini ikut suri kita bersama dengan kita juga. Ya, kita orang khusyuk sangat cerdik juga kita juga. Jadi kita orang aku tertarik juga. Untuk ini daya cerdik ini kami ang mampu untuk juga, mampu untuk kita kira kira kita dilihi ikut juga kita juga. Asyik hari hari aku tertarik juga. Тийм эс өнөөдөр Монгол гэдэг нэрээр авгуулж байгаа та бид нэг бүгдээр Монголын ха нэр доор байгаа юм бүхнийг найдганж явъя. Найдганж хамгаалж оршиж байгаа газар хөрвөд орыл нь Монголдайлж Чингис хаан шиг явж гая гэж би ураалмаар байгаа. За баярлалаа. Сайхан So our last speaker will be uh, Bimpo Darin Chodon from Armangal community. And when I'm going to say in the Chumbal, Darin Chodon is Bimpo Aga, Armangal is Tudor Cha. The Bimpo Arhanga am going to eat Tamar Soming or was bored. Mongols also is in some barrels like Ussik and Ussum barrels during his children natural spanner. The Bimpo and Doom. Dwy'n ergyn mongolchwyd yn үрлэг соэлыйн олон арах ембжиад захуасар ерсэн бүгэд New York Hotno ерснээс ош элэг нэгт монгол турхэн үдэд дүйн томох үүл айжлаан үй цахуан байгуулж ерсэн. Бэмхүүг эй үүл айжлаа зүхүн тусгаар тахсэн монголчууд энэ хаг үүрэнээс халж халмаг бүрээд үүр монгол хазар монголчууд эн and is the president of Mongolian Heritage Foundation. He has organized major cultural events for the East Coast Mongol communities since moving to the New York City. 
to New York City. His events unite not only Mongolians, but also Kalmyk Buryat, Southern Mongols, and Hazar Mongols. Please welcome Bimpo. Sanbetsano. Sapia in the Tomashikti, the Sitkisa, Otto Hutchina, Unutro was a beaten ring, beaten hood of a hundred thing with him. Ah, Hoyming Aronig on the Tahitian Slick Hutling out his nest horse, Townjit in Gushi. Tatiris was shot at the king in tea, but a jig toots, Mashoton, Nights of the Hossa. The Hamgi, Mini Torsum Jail, the Hamgi Hasni Chingsan, the Tatar, Ekit, Mana Unut Mongoso, Kandus Menotek, Chingsaniha, Tahitian Nastar, or Murto, or the Yak in the Bohonshik. Одоо чин зүрхнээс сэтгэлээс одоо юм мөргөж байсан. А тэгээд тэр үеэс хойш одоо өнөөдрийг хүртэл ямар өөрчлөлт миний хувьд гарсан бэ гэхээр а би Чингис хааныг бодохдоо одоо хүндэтгэх дээдлэгтэй а тогтоолт сэтгэлээс чин зүрхнээс мэдрэж дээдлэхийг одоо хүсдэг чармайдаг болсон. За Америкт энэ тахилгын одоо ёслыг одоо нийтдээ 29 жил зохион байгуулж ирсэн Ахмадууд да бид хамгийн түрүүнд баярлалаа гэж одоо бид хэлхийг хүсэж байна. За энэ энд Америкийн монголчуудын соёлын холбооных нь за үнд өдөр зүйлийнх нь Санжалтан, Чингэлдүү ах олон Чингэлдүү ахын гэрүүлийнх нь Цагаан Батрах, Хали, Тооны инхээ ах болон бусад бүх дэмжигчдэд одоо энэ ашигнд одоо баярлаж талгаж байгаа илэрхийлмээр байна. За Тэд бол зүв иргийн монголчуудад нэгдэн нээлэх өв соёлоо хамгаалах, дэлгэрүүлэхэд үнэтэй хувь нэмрээ оруулсан а би тэднээр маш их бах гэж байна. Ихэдсэн Чингис хааны үр хөдөн бож төрснийх хөө үр хариуцлагыг ухамсарлаж ухаан төвөг дээдсээ дээдлэн өв соёлоо дэлгэрүүлж уламжлалаа хадгалцгаа яа. За өнгөрсөн жилүүдэд миний харснаар дахилга дээр тасралтгүй ирдэг Чингис хаана чин зүрхнээсээ шүтдэг хүмүүс утхаа бүхэн байсан. За би би та бүгдийг одоо өрөөлж байна. Чингис хааны дурсгалын санг одоо бүгдээрээ дэмжиж ажилцгаа яа. Алангуу ихийн домогт өгүүлснээр гарын алтгсан таван хуруу шиг газар газрын монголчууд ив нэгдэлтэй байж хамт та нэг том монгол бүлэг болгож хүчтэй байя. Бид Чингис хааныхаа нэрийг байнга дурдаж махтан дууж байх хэвээр яагаад гэвэл өнөөдөр зарим одоо гадны улсууд одоо Чингис хааныг өөр юм болгож одоо хийрч байна. За жишээн хялтууд, орсууд, казак уч юм уу. А бид нар өөрсдөө өөрсдөө Чингис хааныгаа илүү одоо хүндэтгэж одоо биширч дээдлэх ёстой. А гихтэ зөвхөн махтан дуудах биш чин сэтгэлээсээ тахин шүтэх хэрэгтэй байгаа маа. За ингээд ихэдсэн Чингис хааны мэн сүлд биднийг өргөн тэтгэж энд сулдарсан хүн бүрийн хиймэр золбоо дээшээгээ байж монголчууд мэн өн мөнхөд орших болдог ба. Мөнх хөнгөтэй гэр биднийг эмээх болдог ба. Thank you so much, Bimpu, for all the well wishes, and may we be blessed under the eternal heavens. Um, I would like to invite Tony Ettinger, from, um, who will tell us a little bit about the Maka Children's Program. Maka ki hukting hukbrin tazar Tony Ettinger asharxi tazar bidner tajitos hekorsin. So in 1993, we started the Mongolian Children's Aid and Development Fund to help the children of Mongolia as Mongolia was going to transition through its um, movement from communism to capitalism and to a true democracy. Um, every year we've tried to think about the greatest needs for the children of Mongolia and we've helped in ways in providing medicine, in providing clothes, education, um, 
sheep, uh, a variety of ways to help the children. Uh, the last few years, we focused on helping educate the children about the need to protect the land, to protect the animals, not unlike what the shaman were talking about uh, earlier today in the program. And so we've been doing that in a joint venture with the World Conservation Society. Uh, specifically, we have developed uh, what they call trunks, um, big boxes with lots of information and toys and games, all focused on educating the children in the countryside about the importance of protecting the environment and their animals. Uh, we've also supported um, what's called World Bio Biodiversity Day in Mongolia to help, again, educate the children about the needs of protecting the environment. In fact, I brought a poster from World Biodiversity Day. You can see it's aimed at children. Uh, it's got all sorts of animals and children's drawings. And in the corner is the Mongolian Children's Aid and Development Fund, which is our entity, uh, the World WCS, World Conservation Society, and there are several other Mongolian organizations that sponsored the day. So as we move forward, I think we look next year to continuing our relationship with the World Conservation Society. Each year we hope to add other capabilities and welcome any type of support that um, anyone feels like they can give. Thanks so much. the hard work you've been doing and please reach out to Tony if you would like to be part of it and support all these initiatives that are going on for Mongolian children. All right so let's move on to our main part of the event. Um, we will have a keynote address by Dr. Renarsu and he will speak on genomes of Mongolians. What have we learned so far? Дараачийн ам хүчбэрийн гол төлхөр хэлтгэгч бол болох доктор Нарсу тайзан дуурж байна. А доктор Нарсу нь үндэсний хүний гений судалгааны институт үндэсний эрүүл мэндийн институтт ажилладаг бөгөөд өнөөдөр Монголын Монгол ген те Монгол генийн талаар бид одоогийн байдлаар юу олж мэдсэн бэ гэж судалгааныхаа одоо олдуудын талаар ярих баг. Тэгээд now I'd like to invite our keynote speaker Nars uh, Dr. Narsu at the National Human Genome Research Institute and also National Institute of Health and he'll speak on genome of Mongolians. What have we learned so far? Please welcome Dr. Narsu. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I would uh, like to thank Maka for giving me such a wonderful opportunity to uh, present what I have been doing in past few years. Uh, I would like to uh, dedicate this talk to Mr. Bija Borjino, uh, who has been helping a lot of Mongolians, and he has been tirelessly working to get all of the Mongolian different issues on the international uh, stage. Um, okay, uh, I'm going to talk four different things. The first part is going to be very brief introduction of what I'm going to talk about, and as long as you get those few concepts, it's going to be easy to uh, navigate through the talk. Um, the second part is going to be the first Mongolian genome, the first genome that we've sequenced in a few years ago. And the third one is uh, going to be additional 200 genomes that we have sequenced again a few years ago, and we are currently analyzing the data. And the fourth one is a little bit of applications of what 
uh, we can do with these uh, genomes. So, uh, very briefly, everyone know that we have cell, and cell has many different organelles, uh, of which there are two uh, organelles. One of them is nucleus, uh, which has the DNA or the chromosome that we have. We have 23 pairs of chromosomes, of which one pair are sex chromosomes. One is X chromosome and the second one is Y chromosome. Every male has one Y chromosome and uh, one X chromosome. And every female has two copies of X chromosomes. Okay. Um, and if we look at the um, right hand side of this uh, um, slide, we can see that there are double helix DNAs in each chromosome. And if we put together all of the DNAs of all different 22 chromosomes together, we get genome. So essentially, genome is a long stretch of DNAs. The second organelle that I might briefly mention is oh, sorry. I might uh, briefly mention is uh, mitochondria, which is right over here. Um, the special thing about this mitochondrion is that it has its own small piece of DNA and um, uh, the mitochondrion is uh, inherited, inherited uh, maternally. So we get our mitochondrial DNA from our mother. Okay. So, um, Human Genome Project, probably you have heard about Human Genome Projects. So essentially the idea is that instead of we are studying smaller pieces of DNA, let's just sequence the entire chromosome. So the way we do this is that chop the long strand of DNA into a lot of small pieces and then assemble those smaller pieces into slightly bigger scaffolds and then put together all of the scaffolds into one whole big piece of genome. And every one of us have about three million bases of DNA. Okay. So this is a, a piece of DNA. Essentially, it has ACGT in a, almost like seemingly randomly order, but the fact is they are not random, and they have all the uh, genetic information that we need to be who we are. Uh, so 2001, uh, the first human genome was sequenced in the United States. And uh, NIH has um, spearheaded this effort. This is probably one of the biggest biological advances in the uh, past century. OK, uh, so again, coming back to the right-hand side, we have four bases of, uh, 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 in the DNA. And so essentially, we are going to mostly talk about these uh, four bases of, of uh, uh, DNA. So one interesting thing is that DNA has variation. So essentially, some of the bases, or alleles we call, can change to different alleles. So for example, over here, from C to G. Essentially, most of the people have C allele over here, but some people has G, and those changes can make us look different from each other. And that is basically the genomic variation that we are going to talk about. Okay, so if we come back to the, uh, the small piece of DNA, now we can see that there, there are some changes over here in, uh, highlighted in red color. And one thing is that essentially, even though we look very similar to each other, essentially 99.99% .99 of our DNA are all the same, regardless of you are white, 
uh, color, dark color, or whatever color. Okay, so here is an example of what uh, a DNA base change can cause. So essentially, these people have dark skin uh, color, uh, but when there is one base is changed to a different base, their hair color is totally different from ours, what we have as black. And all of the color is simply uh, caused by just one base of change. Okay, here is the dog. And again, only one base of DNA change can make such a huge difference. And on the right hand side, it's, uh, this dog is like essentially racing dog and very muscular. The rest of the entire genome are essentially the same. Okay, so subsequently after sequencing the first genome, uh, uh, U.S. led another effort of sequencing 1,000 genomes. So essentially they selected uh, different people from different continents, from uh, South America, Central America, and North America, um, European, uh, what we call as admixed Americans. So essentially they are admixed uh, populations from European uh, ancestry and Native American ancestry. And then from Africa, uh, these are um, from West Africa and East Africa, and then there are some Europeans, so essentially Caucasians, typical Caucasians. Uh, then there are some people from South Asia, Indians, Bangladesh, and then again, knowingly from East Asia. From East Asia, um, essentially Japanese and two groups of Chinese. Um, so you might wonder that there are a whole lot of places over here, Siberia, Mongolia, Russia, and there has never been anyone sequenced in the depth compared to any other uh, populations over here. So this is like a huge hole, and we don't know pretty much anything about uh, this uh, part of the world. Um, so, so again, uh, um, one thing is when a single base is changed, we call it single nucleotide polymorphism, or in short, SNP. So essentially, people have profiled all of the SNPs, or all of the uh, DNA changes across different populations, included in 1,000 genomes. And so essentially, nowadays, if we want to study a particular gene, we can just go over to the gene and just identify or list out all of the SNPs listed over here, and click on each one of them, and we can get some information about the changes. So for example, over here, there is one SNP on chromosome 6, and this SNP is supposed to be actually GLO, has GLO, but when it is mutated, it can be mutated to ALO. And over here, it tells that, okay, in general population, ALO has about 3.6% of frequency, whereas GLO has 96% uh, of frequency. So essentially means that 96% of the people have the GLO. Okay, now that uh, the, the main topic. So in 2003, there was a very uh, important uh, paper on uh, the genomes of Mongolians. Um, so what they have done is they didn't sequence all of the genomes in the scale that we did uh, lately. However, they have selected about 20 sites <coughs> on Y chromosome. Of, um, uh, of a number of different ethnic groups around the world. And the um, interesting thing is that what they found out is that there is one haplogroup called C3 cluster. And essentially, that's, uh, that's one type of uh, chromosome Y. And they found out that the frequency of this cluster is very, very high in Mongolia and very high in, in uh, Inner Mongolia, and all, almost like all of the regions where Mongolian people reside. Um, the second point is that if you look at the 
size of the um, of this C3 cluster, you see that in Mongolia it's like very big, but essentially slowly uh, the frequency decreases uh, toward the west. Um, so, uh, so what they um, concluded is that essentially this is the reason, uh, this is the result of Mongolian empire expansion about a thousand years ago. So essentially, they have calculated how long it will take to, for a population to get to this kind of frequency if you travel from Mongolia to Europe, which was actually very interesting. A colleague of mine uh, found this article and just brought it to me, and, and we talked about this, actually several colleagues. I was very, very excited. Okay, and several years ago, um, um, a friend of mine who is a, uh, a prominent biologist in Inner Mongolia called Haifa, um, and also a very good friend, she approached me and told me that she is interested in sequencing one Mongolian individual. And at that time, it was very, very expensive. Even now, it is still very expensive. So uh, I was just, I just simply jumped on the opportunity. This is like something I want to do for a long time. Uh, so we selected one individual from Xilinga League of Inner Mongolia. There are several reasons for selecting this individual, but essentially this is a Mongolian individual and this is a male individual so that we can study both all of the 22 chromosomes and also um, the Y chromosome. So essentially we can look at all of the different things in one individual. Uh, so so uh, it was actually very interesting. There are about uh, uh, 143,000 bases of change that has never been observed in any other world population. So which is kind of quite interesting. There must be a lot of things going on with these changes, but unfortunately, we don't know now. And I think this is going to be uh, you know, something that we need to study uh, uh, for years to come. So one uh, thing we learned from this individual is that if we look at the Y chromosome, we actually see that this is, uh, individual doesn't have the most popular C haplogroup that the previous paper identified. However, it has B haplogroup. And this is a kind of little bit of uh, unexpected. We thought that we might be able to actually see C haplogroup over here. But um, you know what we um, see is what it is. Um, we don't have any problem in, in mixing up DNAs or any other technical issues. So we have to believe that this individual has D uh, here. Uh, the haplogroup. So here is a world map. Um, uh, one interesting thing about this uh, D haplogroup is that D haplogroup is um, uh, very frequent in Africa and somewhat frequent in Andaman Island, which is like right over here <coughs> in the south of uh, India. And and then there is almost like no D haplogroup has been found in East Asia. However, there are some in Altai region in Mongolia, which is like kind of puzzling. We all know that all of modern humans originated from Africa and just spread across all of the different uh, continents. So uh, how come all of the East Asians in the south of China and Southeast Asian countries. They don't have this D haplogroup. So that means that at least partially some Mongolians, or at least this individual, has some very, very ancient uh, DNA genetic information. Okay. Um, so here is a, a graph showing that this is one population. So essentially, each pair are uh, a pair of chromosomes. And this is from another population. And two populations, when they mix, their chromosomes also mix as well. And after many, many generations, 
if you look at the people today, you will actually be able to see the footprints from both populations. So essentially, using this information, you can trace back when this admixture happened and to what degree, which is uh, which turned out to be a very useful tool for us. So we all know that Mongolians had a great um, empire expansion about 900 years ago. So when we compare the DNA of this particular individual, along with all of the available data from different ethnic groups uh, around the world, we see this kind of mixture in chromosomes or uh, or DNA very well, and we can almost say that, hey, along the route of um, empire expansion, we can see the footprints of, um, or genetic pr uh, prints of Mongolians. Um, so we uh, published um, this work, uh, let's see, this is about like two years ago. And this is, at that time, it was, I think this is a pretty interesting thing because, again, no one has been fully sequenced from uh, Northern Asia or North part of East Asia. Okay, so I'm going to talk a little bit about another, uh, the, the second project actually, actually, which is a much larger project and uh, um, that we uh, are currently working on. The sequences uh, were generated several years ago and we selected um, several different uh, populations. From the western part of China, we selected some Ayurved uh, Mongolians. And from the eastern part, uh, Brad Mongolian and Harchin Mongolian, uh, Abak and uh, uh, Sunit. And from Mongolia, we also selected some Halak uh, individuals as well. So altogether, we have 200 individuals. Um, so along with 200 blood DNAs, we also um, recorded some clinical information, including uh, cholesterol and uh, uh, blood pressure and blood glucose, all the different things that we could record. Okay, so there are many, many questions we can actually look at using these data. Um, one thing I actually didn't mind uh, uh, mentioning is that, again, this 200 individuals um, no other northern uh, Asians have been sequenced to the degree that we have over here. So this is a really nice kind of data. Uh, so we are hoping that, oh, this data is going to tell us something about, you know, all the different people in North Asia. So here is, I'm going to, you know, tell a few things that I feel like quite interesting. So the left hand plot shows that uh, if we look at the DNA data and spread them out based on their um, variation or changes, uh, then we get this graph. So essentially, if each, each dot represents one individual, and if the distance between two individuals are very close, or uh, ethnically or genetically very close, then they show up very close to each other. So red ones are African samples, and blue ones are uh, Caucasian samples, and then uh, some South Asian samples, Indians and uh, people from um, um, South Asia, and um, light green ones are admixed Americans, or admixed uh, Native Americans. And the green ones are East Asians, including Chinese, Japanese, um, uh, uh, groups. And the right hand side is uh, the same graph, but we added Mongolians. So if you see the left hand side, there is actually a huge gap that has not been filled. And when we add Mongolians, our Mongolian samples actually filled up this gap very nicely. It tells two things. One is that Mongolians are genetically somewhat different from the rest of the East Asians, from Japanese or from uh, the Chinese that uh, have been studied. And they are essentially, they are also different from other people. So this is like very, very cool kind of thing. 
and the data is going to be very useful for a lot of different uh, studies. Okay, so this is a, uh, uh, um, these are the samples of East Asians, and we, if we do a principal component, same kind of analysis, we can see that all of the Mongolians are on the left uh, lower corner. And these are Japanese samples and Chinese samples. So essentially we can, if we look at the genetic data, we can separate out pretty much reliably all of the different ethnic groups. Okay, uh, I'm not sure how much time I have. But um, one thing is that um, people originated, all of the modern humans originated from uh, Africa, but how did they come along uh, into different continents? We don't know much. We all know that, oh, they came out from here, and somewhat probably uh, through South Asia and along the, the coastal lines, somehow entered East Asia from the south of China or Southeast Asia. Asia. And another group maybe, maybe migrated from, uh, uh, from Middle East or Central Asia into uh, into uh, the east, uh, in East Asia. Uh, so, so we have Mongolian DNA data, and so I thought that okay, if we we have some fully sequenced data, what about if we get some um, genetic data from Siberia? Siberia, because there are a lot of different ethnic groups. Please uh, uh, forgive my. Uh, ignorance if I'm uh, noting some of the ethnic groups over here different from another as you might like. But again, there are apparently some data that people have sequenced selected sites of genomes, not the whole genome sequences. And there are data available for a lot of Siberians. So I contacted um, you know, the authors of these uh, uh, papers, and we got the, 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 uh, the DNA data. So we combined all of these different ethnic groups, DNA data, along with our data, and adding all different other uh, world populations data, and tried to see that, okay, tell me how Mongolians are different from the rest of the world. So here is a graph. So essentially, the way to understand this is that if the black R is big, that means uh, the population or ethnic groups on the, red, on the left hand side are, um, um, are very close to Africa, Africans. So, so as we see, these green ethnic groups are all from South Asia, which actually makes sense because Africans came out of Africa and then some of them probably got to South Asia and the second group that I was very surprised was actually different groups of Siberia. And after that, Mongolians, um, the samples that we put together, and then Tibetans. And then almost like all of the East Asian groups, including Chinese and, and uh, Japanese, they pretty much don't share much with African groups, indicating that actually East Asians are very, very far away from Africa compared to any other groups, genetically. Uh, so there, uh, this is a plot of uh, showing Siberians plus Mongolians. So the blue dots represent Mongolians, the green dots represent Han Chinese, and so essentially there seem to be like two different branches. One branch is that Mongolians are very similar to the groups over here, including Hante and of course Tuva, Ahte, um, etc. And then another group is actually very similar to the Eastern um, ethnic groups of Siberia. Um, so there's a whole lot of other data that available. We are speculating about Native Americans, how they entered Native uh, North America, all the kind of things. But this is like very interesting for us. Um, so so uh, almost like everyone's 
who studies this kind of data would like to know that, okay, tell me something about the phylogeny of uh, different ethnic groups. So again, Africans are over here. So essentially, the way you need to look at this graph is then look at the roots of each branch. So Africans are the oldest population over here. And from Africa, seems like there are two splits over here. One group, or, uh, one group includes the, uh, South Asians, Asian uh, populations, including India and uh, people from Bangladesh. And then that group extended further, and this is uh, Caucasian group, European samples. And if we go further, we see that some um, South Asians are over here. So essentially, these South Asians and these South, South Asians, genetically, they are very similar to each other. They just, on the graph itself, part of them uh, came to the left-hand side. And then, uh, uh, then some Oceanians. Uh, from there, if we look further, now here are Western Siberians and Eastern Siberians. And over here, uh, Central Siberians, and then extending into Eastern Siberia. So essentially what this tells is that Eastern Siberians are genetically probably further away from Africans compared to the West uh, Siberians. And now back to Mongolia. Where have people are very, very close to this, uh, other Mongolians over here, which makes sense because uh, we are genetically very close to each other. From here, there appears to be two different uh, splits. One split went into Tibet, and Tibetans and Nashi people, two people, which are essentially Mongol uh, people in, in uh, uh, Qinghai province of uh, China. And that, again, makes sense. So essentially, one group went into Tibetan plateau and formed a unique group of people, East Asians. And the other group, starting from Archin over here, Archin Mongolians over here, went uh, split into Japanese and Han Chinese and Southeast Asians. So essentially this tells that most likely the human migration has been something like this. Again, all of these data, most of the, these data from 200 genomes are not published. But we speculate that after humans came out of Africa, migrated north, and then from the west of Siberia, entered Asia, and had two different splits. One split went directly toward the east of Siberia, far east, and the other one went south into Mongolia, or Mongolia and then had two different splits. One went directly into the southern part of China, and the other one uh, went through a uh, Tibetan plateau and uh, in this way. This is actually very different from most, uh, most uh, accepted theory of human migration in East Asia. Okay, so there are many, many questions we actually can ask, and this is just we are just touch, touching the iceberg, uh, really the surface of uh, what we can do over here. Uh, we can look more details about, uh, look at uh, more details about Mongolians and Siberians or other people, and uh, uh, Mongolians and Native Americans, and we can also trace uh, descendants of Chinggis Khan. And uh, uh, since we have very nice catalog of different variation of Mongolian people, we can look at um, genetic basis of different diseases of uh, uh, Mongolians. We also can use these information to aid medicine, uh, I think, in the pretty near future. Uh, okay, so, so I would like to mention several people that I collaborate with, uh, Dr. Hi, uh, Fabi, Inner Mongolian, uh, Inner Mongolian University of Nationalities, and she's an outstanding scientist, and Xiao Xingguo, who works at Beijing Genome Institute. Again, another uh, 
fantastic scientist to work with. And Dr. Carlos Bustamante from Stanford University, Dr. David Reich uh, from Harvard University, both of them are the top-notch population genetics in the world. And this is the research group that I work with. And I, would, uh, I have to thank my boss, uh, Francis Collins, who gave me the freedom to work on this project. He uh, uh, just told me that, hey, if you need any kind of resource, if you need any kind of computing power or time, um, just uh, go ahead and work on it. Even though I don't want you to work on other projects, but since this is something you like, go ahead and do it. Um, that's all. Thank you very much. Can you please uh, let the audience know, maybe just in very briefly Mongolian? Yeah. Um, uh, you're you're kind of a little. You're kind of a little. I'm going to say, 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 I'm Shalaksness will have a possible Dilhina all non snow mosin to stay at Snazula, Manaus, Nick Dumnil to the Hunt to Hitten. A fair tip was Hatch Snazula, Hashin Yawad Unthuk, Bangladesh, Dirwafar, Dara, the Hat Hoshiwa, Shivarin, Barnt Hatur, Hoyer Hoaga, Nukskin, Baranshara, Yoro. Lucaskin, two shard, she were a roxman. She were the oxen, but room of the hat hoyer hoga, look, but good shot, she were a tuition, she were a juice of bread, Lugon would be a she were in don't discussion, or shard, a tetter or seaman. When no more the Hamas son of the Julia would give a chin. That good Tanaste Christian. Bye.